Welcome back, my solistic friends and family. This is Shanika, your solistic jewelry artist. And I'm coming back with another video because I just finished another artwork. And, oh, I think you see it in the video. Let's see. Here she is. Here she is. I have not named her. I see my camera light. So I hope it ain't no distraction. Let me see if I can put her here. Let me turn one of them off. I was thinking I needed another light. So let me turn this one off and see if that'll help. Let me bring it back in the camera. Here she is. Okay, yeah, the other light helped. So I have her in almost like an eight by 10 frame. And what I'm doing is getting ready. I was gonna do my own personal um, my own personal jewelry art sale, but my sister-in-law for Mother's Day in the month of May, she's having a Mother's Day brunch, and she was looking and asking about vendors. This is my little trash over here. And I told her, well, what do you think about me being a vendor uh, for the Mother's Day brunch? in may and she was said she said absolutely so i signed up as one of the vendors and i am looking forward to the show and for my new craft i have not named her and i was hoping that my friends and family would name her for me. Give me some choices and options for her. Now we know about the pink queen over here. Ooh, look at my little Asher arms. So now we know the pink queen. I just knew her when I started. When I saw that paper, I knew I was gonna name her pink queen. And everybody know that in all my crafting uh, work, I always have a butterfly. So I was able to create her, this butterfly over here. Um, and I did give her a little puppy. So she would be up for sale. And I like that she has a back. So, of course, I take that little sticker off I bought the frame for so the pink queen will be for sale at the um at the brunch so she's gonna have three vendors we're gonna be doing candle making and what else we're going to be doing um she said candle making we're gonna do mothers uh, affirmations and she's got quite a, a a itinerary for us so I am very very looking forward and excited for that day with her and I'm getting ready to put all my extra stuff up I have one that I had so, let me get back to that right fast because I'm all over the place. So, back to her. I need you guys to give... I see that ring. Like, can y'all still see her? When I get close, the ring comes on. So, let me see if I can change the tone of the light. Let me just take her out the light. Well... Let me take her out for you. Whoop. Let me just 
take her out the light. Let me get the phone. Okay. And take her out the light. That's better. I'll turn the ring in this way. Ring. So while I get the room together, my little craft area, uh, I wanted you all to see her. And tell me, what do you think? What is her name? She's got a little... Let me see. Is that a fuzz? No. So, that's her. When I tell y'all, I had so many beads down here. But, because it's in that frame, and they was attached to other beads. So, I will go back in. Because I do have some leftover ones. Because I want to make sure that she's very... Yeah. So, I do have some more of these. So, I will go in and add more. It's just very hard. And I like that I found these little... Um, those little black beads, too. So, I liked it that. Um, so... Help me name her. And so I will put her up. And that the day before, no, probably just the day of. I won't make any promises because I'm supposed to be doing a video every Tuesday. But I did not last Tuesday because I don't. Oh, honey. I tell you. So, um. Let me know if you guys can help me name her. And then by next Tuesday, I'll pick a winner. And let's see what else. Hmm. So I will have her for sale. What you think? And you see, I got her a little earring in her ear. And it's just a um. Just the image of a woman. Just what you call it. The, the um, what is that word called when you have the, the um, image of a woman? So, I have her. And, um, of course, like I said, in my light, we have the pink queen. And even behind the pink, uh, behind the other one, I will sell that one. Family word. Life begin and love never ends. So that image right there. So these just a few. And of course, I thought about keeping my little butterfly, but I will be bringing that one as well. And the tree as well. I will be bringing that one. And, oops the tree and also this little cute one I will be bringing I'm going to try not to bring too many because my feelings will be so crushed if not even one person buys them so but that's life you know if you don't that's fine you just say that's okay you know I bring them home and then maybe I can try on the marketplace or this way to another event. And um, I got a few up here. Let me see if I can bring it down. Okay, so this one right here, I will be selling that one as well. Um, of course, not my lips. I would not be selling that because I remember when I done that one. This is like one of my first ones. And it meant something to me. When people try to silence you. And this image right here reminds me so much of my praises. Of my praises and the praise that I give to the Heavenly Father. So, this is a keeper. So... This was definitely poured out from my heart. So that one, 
is a keeper, which is stay home. And this one, I, I'm thinking I'm going to even sell her because I've had her so long. This is one of my first ones because you can see my paper coming up on the side. And my grateful sign don't fail. So I will attach that somewhere. So I'm thinking I will even get rid of that one. I'm not sure about that one yet. And I will be bringing this one. When I lost my nephew, this was one that was dear to my heart. But um, I can let it go. So this is one also that I will be bringing to the sale. And uh, let me show y'all this one, guys. Let me go get it. How do I sit this down? Let me sit this here and go get, get this and show you guys. So this one right here, <laughs> when I tell you I have such a love for the sea and water, I do. So I tried to do a mermaid, so that didn't work. I ended up just making it like a mystical, mystic kind of thing. So this one would be for sale. Uh, I would be letting that one go. I enjoyed it. And as a matter of fact, I have like, and I do, I like the fishes. Look at the little bitty fishes. Is it focused? There it is. Oh my God, ain't they the cutest? They are so cute. The little fishes. And then I even found that to kind of make it like the seaweed. And look at that goldfish. It's beautiful to me. Um, I want to get into some uh, other images, but that's one that I will sell. Now, this one right here, I will be selling too. I don't know. I'm kind of having a struggle with this one because... Um, I don't know why. I don't know what to do with the fin. I don't know what to do with the fin. And that's why I wanted to kind of leave it alone. Because I'm thinking for the fin, I need like some jewelry that um that can looks like feathers or you know um this looks like fin, and, and I just don't have that. So, this will be an item for sale. Because what I'm thinking, what I might do, I, what I do, I had a little fish. Let me see what I do. I had a, a fish up here. Let me see if I stuck them in the bag. Because... Hmm. What I might do with this one. Oh, I don't know what I do with my little fish. Let me see my little fish. Did I move it? I must have moved it. I pulled the little fish out. Well, it's up here somewhere. So... What I wanted to do was to add like all my seat. Uh, let me put the light back over here. Add all of my seat. Let me see. This. No, it's not here. Oops. It's not here. Oh, uh, let me see. So it's really difficult. See, something like, where's my hand at? Here it is. Something like this. And what is this? That's like a snake or an eel. 
Let's go back some. Yeah. So, maybe like that. I got to see what I do with the fish. But I'm going to finish this one. And uh, bring that one with me as well. Just a few on my table. Just a few. Um... Yeah, that's about it, you guys. I just want you to know what I finished. I was trying to find it. Look, it's a beautiful fish. If I find it, I might have moved it because I'm shocked I did because I had left it out. Because I was going to work on that next. But I don't put it somewhere. I'm not worried about the bottom of that right there because... Um, I couldn't jury it that anyway. And that's that's it sitting up. And um, so that's it. I'm going to add my signature butterfly in there somewhere. Um, let's see if there's anything else. Oh, there is um, two more. So this one, I will be selling her at the event. And this one. And that one. That's a beauty. That'd be nice in a sunroom somewhere. That's gorgeous. So, how many is they? That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. That's it. So I have 13 pieces that I'll be bringing with me and I will be getting me um, online, ordering me some bags. I think I'm going to do probably a medium to a large bag with the um, wrapping paper. So I'm finding Amazon some sort of wrapping paper, something cute. So when they purchase, I can wrap their um, art up and... Um, what else so some gift paper i need to order and then also i need to order some tags because i am going to write out some sort of message and note from me on each like note card about the art that's a tag so they can not long but just something that i kind of give a description you know um, I'll be right back. My son calling. Hold on, guys. Okay, I'm back. My son was calling me. And that's that son that, ooh, when you get them calls, honey, you got to stop what you're doing. So, it was one of them calls. Um, yeah, so everything was okay with him. Um, so this is my sign that I will have at the event. Um, she's naming it Sunflower and Sundresses. So she's not sure yet if she's going to provide us a tablecloth, but I think a simple black tablecloth. So everything else can pop out or white. I don't know yet because I ain't never done it before. So when I told her to give me, she's going to let us know. It's going to be that Saturday. I think Mother's Day May the 14th and her event is going to be that Saturday, maybe the 13th. So um, if y'all have any ideas, what I need to have on the table, of course, I will be doing the um, picture holders. Uh, so I would do like order about 10. And um, so like my art that does not have, like this one does not have, you know, the picture stand, then I can have the stand that they can, you know, lean on so i'm gonna do i'm gonna try to order those 
Um, and like I said, I have this out front, which is um, my name, Shanika Solistic Jewelry Art. And of course, find me another E. I know I have it when I uh, when it's somewhere, but I don't know where. Because once I set up, I saw that was missing. So I should be able to find those at a hobby uh, lobby or somewhere. That list missing letter. Uh, let's see what else I need to do. Oh, so how about the fish I was telling you about where I knew I had it at? It was up there. So here's the fish. And what I'm going to do, I decided to do is I'm going to um I'm going to I'm gonna paint um her fan in a metallic color. I'm gonna once I decor it, I'm gonna do it in one color. So here is the fish that I was telling you guys I had. Isn't that gorgeous? Uh, I thought the paint was chipped, but actually, focus. Oh, look at it. Oh my gosh. My hands. Um, yeah, so that's cute. Um, about putting it here or putting it in the water. I'm not sure yet where I'm going to put it at, but I liked it the fish. <laughs> when I saw this fish uh in my craft, I was like, yes. And of course, I made sure it wasn't a name on it. So it is just a costume piece. So I will put that piece in. And I like the um other. Let me see if I can open up this bag with one hand. Other pieces too, like I have a turtle that I can add. So I don't know yet. That's something I'd be working on. <sighs> because I'm going to color everything in one metallic. So that's what I am going to finish. Because I had all these seashells that I had on it. But then I took them off. I was like, I don't like the seashells. Um, Here. So maybe I can put it in the fin. But, um... Or maybe I can get a leaf, not a leaf, a feather, and maybe somehow incorporate the feather into the um, the fan. So I don't know. So that's something that I have not completed, and I don't want to rush it. I don't want to rush that. So like I said, I'm getting ready for my sister-in-law event. This is one of my favorite necklaces. Um, I have not even been wearing it. The ginger snap necklace. I used to wear this all the time. I think I had came home one day and took it off. And um, stuck it behind my picture because I must have had company that day or something. But, um, yeah, this one of my favorite necklaces. So, that's about it, guys. Don't forget to name our new lady. Um, let's see what else. I think that's it for now. Let me get all my reading glasses. And of course, the shoe house. I am waiting on a friend to complete my, she's painting. I'm going to make a fairy. What do you call it? A fairy garden? And she's painting my um, pottery pot. I sand it down. All she had to do is paint it. It's been like a month. But when people do stuff for you, you know, you don't want to rush them. But, of course, I don't get people to do nothing without some sort of token of appreciation. Uh-oh. So, believe me, she will be compensated for it. But it's been so long, I'm thinking about getting it. Because I have another uh, friend... Uh, who daughter paints and she's the one that actually painted this for me the waves and um i might get her to do it because this you know it's been too long 
and I still haven't gotten it back yet. But, oh, yes, child. That's been a task. So, I let me put her in V for you guys. Um, okay, let's put that here because I'm going to finish that. Um, let's see what else. Um, I think that's about it. I'm sorry, I keep touching that light. So here she is. Help me with the name for her. I do love her. And I did like the little black beads because of the little background that I had in that paper. This kind of highlighted the dress. And um, I thought about the flower in her hair because of the event. So she can have her sunflower. And you know, there's the butterfly. It's a butterfly halter dress she's wearing. And let me put these all up. Um, what I would do is in another video as it get closer like one day on one of my Tuesday because I've got all my art now once I finish the uh, mermaid fin um, or mermaid tail once I finish that one I will go on and start packing and I have this roller cart that I will put everything in and, and carefully roll it. And of course, like I said, each art piece will have its own meaning and its own name. And I just do just a brief detail with um, the item of it. So, yes. I am going to leave this one alone because I wanted to kind of add another trim around that. But I like the way it sits up and you can see the star. So I, I like that. I like that piece. This is a nice piece. This will probably be one of my expensive pieces. The rest of them, not expensive. Um, yeah. But that's about it. This little jar I use to kind of like keep stuff near. I'll go through it based on what I'm working on. But that's it, you guys. I will see you all in the next video. Look at my little strawberry. I saw this little plush um this little plushie in the store i was like oh caroline had a little cute strawberry i want me a cute strawberry so she had her strawberry in her um her background and her picture and when i saw this one i had to hurry up and got and get it i was like she's too cute with the rosy cheeks so i really like her um Yep, so that's it. I um will see y'all in the next video. Bye guys. And remember, stay humble and kind. Do your best. Bye.